welcome to the new world and welcome to another video tutorial i'm happy to have you around my channel again this week and for today's lesson i'm going to show you how to play this beautiful song just a closer walk with me by the way this is one of my favorite songs and i hope the chord the lead part even the rhythm i'm going to show you gonna help you to improvise in your own way so uh, as i said i always say this channel is not just to try to copy the same thing i do but to help you to create your own stuff so that's how it works and i hope this video will help you to create your own stuff so before i start i would like you to subscribe to like to share to comment and even click on the bell so that you don't miss anything when i upload a new video so let's get into it all right cool i'm gonna show you everything that i just played and i hope it's gonna help you so i'm busy in the key of g major and i will not use uh the normal g or the normal c or even the d i will be using the seventh chord so instead of using this g here i will be using a g7 Instead of using a C, I will be using a C7. And again, uh, instead of using a D, I will be using a D7. Dominant 7, by the way. So, to put my G7, uh, you just go with uh, your A minor shape to the 3rd fret, and then you put... Uh, this finger up here your index finger and then uh, to put a c c uh, major seven you put it this way here on the third fret so just check and then you put you meet your index finger here and then i play uh, a d dominant seven so you have your c shape you go with it to your fifth fret and then you add your pinky down here. So if I remove your pinkies here and then you play this way here. And then there is also a chord, a diminished chord. I played, which is here. And to put this diminished chord, the same way you put your C7, you just uh, move your your middle finger up and then you have your diminished chord so this is a c sharp diminished chord c sharp diminished so that's uh, i think all the chords are just used so uh for the rhythm i'm playing once like one down one down one down one down so uh, it's going to be easy for you. If you want uh, to use your fingers, you are welcome to use it. But if you want to use, like myself, a pick, you can also use it. But it's better. I recommend you to use a pick. So I'm using uh, a pick and then I'm doing one down. And then I'm making sure that uh, my fifth string and my first one is muted so i'm playing the last strings and those three three ones in the middle so that's how i play it and then uh again if you are on your c7 diminish chord that's how i play it Again, uh, there's something I played something like this. So before going to my D7, I'm playing uh, here the B, I'm playing the C, and I'm playing the C sharp, and then I'm going to my D7. So I'm still playing one down, one down, one down. And 
and then I start leading. So to lead this song, it's also easy. So if you want to lead the song, uh, something that you need to know is I'm busy uh, in the G major scale, which is here on the fifth fret. And then there is also a G major scale up here. So, so when you have this code, you can put your G uh, major scale this way. And then uh, I also use the E minor pentatonic up here again. That's how I play it. So everything here will be connected together. So to play uh, the lead, I start something like this. So I'm playing chromatically. Again. how I play it. So if you want to see it again for the last time, because I'm busy with uh, uh, the major pentatonic, sorry, 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 the major scale, sorry. So it started like this. I stop here and then I go down again So I'm busy with uh, the G major scale here. So if you notice, I'm here. And actually, I'm playing something like this. That's how I play it. And then I come back again here. something like this again busy with uh, the G major scale so this is how I play it again I come back down here Again, let's do it again, and then so I'm busy with uh, the um, the major scale, and then I come here using the minor pentatonic. But actually, also this one, it's still uh, the major scale because if I take it this way here. Mm -hmm. So this is still a major uh, scale. So I start here and then I go up uh, and then I place something uh, like this. Again, so you are bending a little bit, and then after that, I play something like this. Again.
I'm playing again chromatically. The first time I was going down, but now I'm going up. So I'm playing chromatically. So this is my last one. I finish like this. So still busy with uh, the major scale. So our major scale is like this, but I'm playing a string which is outside. And then after that, I go back uh, doing this strumming. So which is easy and you can do it also. By yourself so this is how I play it thanks for watching this video I hope this lesson has improved your way of playing and I hope this lesson uh, has also improved the way you can improvise by yourself uh, again I would like you to try to add more stuff to what you just learned today I would like also to memorize those chords and then try to use them with other songs, which I know will sound nice. But this video is almost over, but before it finishes, I would like you again to subscribe, to like, to comment, even share. And also remember to click on the bell so that you don't miss anything when I upload a new video. And if you do all of these things, it will be appreciated by me. So see you next week for another video tutorial. Until then.